Hello everybody, you're looking live at a tremendous setting. One for the ages, people. Behind me is the unveiling of North Law Farm Way. I keep getting that wrong, but it's the Joe North Way. And uh, we just finished the ceremony here at Dunbar High School and on the corner of Edison Avenue and Barton Street where Joe North grew up. And now uh, we placed the Joe North Way on there. And we have some people here who are so instrumental in today's uh, program, making it happen, and so important to the city of Fort Myers. To my left, we have the chief of the fire department, Tracy McMillian. Welcome to Leapfish Live again. Thanks for having me again, Lee. Appreciate it. Longtime friend of Joe North as well. And we have LaShawn Collier, the marketing director and everything go-to person for the city of Fort Myers Community Redevelopment Agency. When I say everything go-to, what's that other part to your title? Deputy Director of Communications. Yeah, get that mic up there a little bit. Deputy, Deputy Director, Director of Communications. Yeah. There you go. Uh, and uh, Michelle Hilton Terry is the Executive Director. We shout you out, Michelle. Right. Yeah. But uh, I think she was not able to make it today. She wasn't feeling well. She sends her regards. And, um, of course, our entire team works under her leadership. And this would not have been possible without that. And you guys uh, played a, a monumental role as Councilman Johnny Streets of Ward 2 indicated you guys did a lot of the behind the scenes of pulling this all off and getting it through the, the government uh, red tape, huh? <laughs> Let's just call it red tape. Uh, tell me what, what role the CRA actually played in this. So Mr. Streets, Commissioner Streets, because he is the commissioner for the CRA Board of Directors, Correct. came to us with an idea. And he said, this is what I want to do. And he turned it over and said, okay, just like he said, make it happen. And so the CRA was in on the beginning planning stages of it, making sure that the communications were what we needed, making sure that we could get people in line with the city. But it was a citywide effort. You know, so many people played a role at different phases into making this um, event come to fruition. And that's what the best teams do. The yeah. CRA works, you know, hand in hand with the city all the time. And it was really wonderful that all of us were able to make this um, renaming of Barden Street into Joe North Way. It feels really monumental mm -hmm. for the community. What was it like for you to sit out there and know how all of this started behind the scenes mm -hmm. and to see the great turnout and see uh, an idea come to reality? Well, you know, it was a lot of fun. <laughs> you know, it felt like we were doing something clandestine uh -huh. in the beginning without anybody knowing. And then as the pieces started um, coming together, it was like it was really going to happen. And then it left our office and went to other offices to go to yet other offices. And Brian and his team put together the wonderful event today. Um, so it was, it was just fun. You kind of felt as if you were a part of a really wonderful surprise. It was not like, I have never seen uh, street naming, uh, and certainly in Fort Myers done in such a, uh, a stylish way, uh, fit for, uh, Senator of Dunbar, Attorney Joe North, fit for uh, a, a native, a citizen who has uh, just done us proud here in the largest African American community in Southwest Florida. Tracy McMillian, the Chief of the Fire Department, you were out there taking it all in. You've seen a lot of great things happen uh, in this community. You ever? And I'm certainly you've been to some street naming ceremonies, but uh, how would you rank this one? Uh, this has actually set a new standard, obviously. Uh, the professionalism, uh, the feel, the vibe of it. Uh, almost in my head, I think about a family reunion mm -hmm. because it felt like, man, we were just here to celebrate, which we were, to celebrate a man who's done so much, who's impacted so much, but just to feel the vibe of people hugging each other just left and right. It seemed like you couldn't go two steps mm -hmm. before you had to speak to somebody. And, mm -hmm. and that just shows the network. And one of the words you talk about all the time, how people can be brought together. Mm -hmm. And truly, Joe North, yourself, and LaShawn and others have brought people together. And just to see all that happen here today and see it at this level, yeah. it definitely was befitting of Joe North to have this type of ceremony with this many people, with this type of vibe. It was really special. Went off without a hitch. Yes, sir. And uh, I'm sure back at the uh, fire department, I guess you guys on your maps, you'll have the honorary uh, <laughs> Joe North on, 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 on way uh, on Barton Street uh, as a addendum, right? Yes, absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. So our guys will be trained, and that's one of the things that's special because in order to train, you first got to give the history. 
Mm-hmm. So what does it mean for Joe Northway? Mm-hmm. So we can talk about how this this uh, young brother actually grew up on Barton Street and was able to actually come to here as a middle school and, and just to be able to transition to be the great lawyer and attorney that we know him to be and having his law firm and how his son's working with him. Mm-hmm. So we can tell that story. Mm-hmm. And so now that story will actually get, begin to actually permeate throughout our department, permeate through our community, and then it just gives others an opportunity to look at that sign and say, you know what, I know there's a way. Mm-hmm. Because Joe has already lived that way and gone right. that way. It just creates so much. I, I'm just, man, I'm in awe today. I'm in awe. Yeah, and no no aspersion to athletes, but Joe has done this purely off ingenuity, academics, uh, in, uh, just a steward of the books, becoming a great lawyer, one of the best in the country, and that says a lot in terms of a role model. Mm-hmm. What you say, LaShawn? Oh, absolutely. I think that there's a place for all kinds. Um, and often some other groups get more attention than others. But this shows you, you know, those who, those of us who may be bookworms, those of us who really want to um, have a passion around justice, you know, around freedom, around helping people who are hurting, you know, this naming of the street gives um, a reflection and a mirror back to other people who feel the same way. So, I, go ahead. It's, Okay. You're doing okay, because I know you could, you're doing good. Uh, how historic is it, uh, uh, Chief, that Dunbar High School just happened to be sitting on this corner and we could <laughs> utilize this property? Can you can, can we make that up? You can You couldn't have anything better than that. I mean, it's uh, and uh, you know, Joe when he was speaking, kind of talked about it, and it's and it's so uh, I guess to a sense prophetic mm-hmm. uh, that you know. And I know he grew and growing up didn't know that this was going to happen. Mm-hmm. But to know that the vision and, and the plan was already in place mm-hmm. for this moment is special to be a part of that. Mm-hmm. Just to know that the life he lived and the contributions he's made has come to this, where the street that's named after him points to, mm-hmm. points to mm-hmm. uh, not only Dunbar High School, but also the, the stadium that's named after him. Mm-hmm. And so that is so special. And I just love every bit of it. I know when I was up there saying that if you brought this script to Hollywood to Spike Lee and uh, Tyler Perry and Spielberg, they would throw it out because it just couldn't happen. I saw you being a thespian over there smiling when I was making that parable. Uh, speak to that as well. Well, I think this is one of the things that I talked about with you or to you so often is the keeper of our stories, the griot of the community. Um, and our stories deserve to be told. And for you having this wonderful platform always showing us ourselves in our most remarkable light, mm. you know, is a really, really important um, job. It's a really important responsibility. And so here we are again, unfolding another chapter, <laughs> yes. and you are here yes. curating it all for us to know, to remember, and to be seen and told in a way that is honest and true, and in a way um, that is done with heart and love. Well, I'm just glad to be a part of it. I've received that with humility, and I'm just grateful that we have people like you and and Tracy McMillian to carry this story farther away. Tracy, look into that camera. Final comments, Chief, to Joe North. Joe, I love you. I love the opportunities and that you give me to just watch you. I'm able to glean so much from you, your your confidence, your humility, your selflessness, your ability to be in any room, any space, and just be Joe. And that is so special. And and whether you know it or not, the the, the example that you're you're living and leading, we're watching and we're growing from you just being you. So I encourage you, just keep on keeping on, keep doing great, and don't let anybody, anybody get in your way, Joe, because we know we got a street that's gonna take you there. Yeah. Phi Beta Sigma in the house. Final comments to Joe North. I think what I would want to say is there is something out in the lexicon uh, of people that we call our true north. And it speaks to uh, our hearts being pointed, our intentions being pointed, guidance that is giving our way of a true north. And Joe has been a true north of this community. Mm. Um, And so the symbolism of that is not lost. And we thank you for being that for us and for your family um, and for those yet to come. And to you, Joe North, as I said, nobody can do everything, but everybody can do something. 
And if everybody does something, everything gets done. And that is truly what you represent. So remember, Miami might have the oranges, but the North Law Firm and Joe Northway have got the juice. <laughs> we'll be back. Lee Pitts Live is a Lee Pitts Enterprise production. Hello, everybody. This is Lee. I'm so glad that you watched that particular show. And if you enjoyed that show, we got other shows like that. Just subscribe to our YouTube channel. Watch Lee Pitts Live on demand anytime. And also hit us up on all our social media platforms. Just type in Lee Pitts Live and there you go.